Good afternoon, everybody. This is your proud plan babe now. My name is Kelly, and I'm so glad that you guys were able to join me today. Today, what we are going to be talking about is Semi Hydro. Now, this is my Epi, and it's beautiful, half moon, and it even has this beautiful new little baby growing out of it. Now, I'm going to go ahead and show you guys how I went ahead and converted this from sphagnum moss into LECA. Now, behind me, as you can see, I do have my variegated monstera and a couple other plants in here that are in LECA. They are thriving, and I just kind of wanted to show you guys the cool thing about LECA is not having fun with the ants. I'm going to whisper up so they don't come back. Anyways, but let's go ahead and come on back. My epi. I'm sorry, she's a little shaky. I'll try and hold her still. But I'll go ahead and zoom this in so you guys can see the leaf pattern on this baby. This beautiful half moon. This one has a slight variegation of this left leaf, right leaf. But what we're going to be doing today is removing the sphagnum moss off of this and converting this into semi hydro. Now, as you can see, I have some of my plants back here, like my variegated monstera back here, a couple plants up here, my dragon scale in LECA, and they're loving it. So let's go ahead and put this baby into LECA and see how it does. All right, let's go on in. First, um, I don't like to yank very much when it comes to sphagnum moss, just because I can like feel my soul coming out of me gently pull oh this is terrifying but geez look at these beautiful roots beautiful beautiful oh love 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 that one's so thick sorry if i'm like not in the picture very much i'm trying to focus This is like terrifying for me. I push you somewhere. Now I'm gonna go ahead and do this for a little while. Um, but I'll time lapse this so you guys can see how it goes. All right, so I have comfortably removed most of the sphagnum moss in here, and I didn't expect these beautiful roots. Let's go ahead and just kind of bunch this in there. Okay, you'll be fine, buddy. You'll be fine. Oh, hello, friend. Alright, so. Now I've gone ahead and got some water, and I kind of forgot to put in the clone, Clomex, but I will be putting in some Super Thrive into there. Now, it was thriving on sphagnum moss, so I don't want to like, traumatize it, so I still want to give it some Super Thrive. Now, I'm going to drop about... One, two drops, maybe three just for the love. All right, and then that's about it on the Super Thrive. And now we're just going to go ahead and fill this baby up. I want to make sure I kind of get you guys in the picture. Right around there.
And that is it. Hopefully this baby thrives. And that is all. So I will go ahead and keep you guys updated on how this beauty does in its semi-hydro. If you guys have any questions, please make sure to drop them below. Remember, this is your proud plant babe. And my name is Kelly. So thank you so much for stopping by. And I'll talk to you guys all soon. Bye.